is in her garage on Chicago's northwest side. She is building a single-engine airplane. Paris Schutz of the Chicago Tonight staff went to meet this ambitious young aviatrix to find out what is propelling her. Sabrina Gonzalez Pastersky says that at age five, she knew what she wanted to do with her life. We're walking around. Sort of what it felt like the first time you were up in the air. It's really like freedom, that flight that nothing else like to passion for it. That, um... So at age 13, Sabrina began a new project. It's not so much a question of saying that I'm very grateful to Sabrina for agreeing to present these two lectures. Okay, this is for me too. Great, thank you. Great. Um, okay, so, um, well, this is sort of, but I guess I'm on the board because it's kind of a good thing to keep in mind. Um, when we go through things, they're going to be a little bit uh, more just technical and personal. Um, personally, I love the memory next to this, and I get to talk about it next time. Um, but when you're studying NASA's scary, and you're looking uh, at like the low frequency limit of the extra attached speech. She's already a certified pilot, and now she's building her own airplane. Meet an ambitious young 14-year-old from Chicago's northwest side who's reaching for the sky. I'm for science, technology, engineering, and math, and we're going to discover the power of learning, and that, yes, girls too can reach for the stars, literally. I'm referring, of course, to Sabrina Gonzalez um, Pastersky, She's a PhD student at Harvard University and she's taking the world of physics by storm. So as you saw in the video, um, at the age of 14, she was building a plane in her parents' garage. I don't know what's happening in your garage, it's not happening in mine. Okay? And now, 10 years later, she is doing pioneering work in the field of quantum gravity. So why is that important? Her research could potentially transform our understanding of space and the universe we live in. Uh, when I want to like motivate myself to do more, I think like what have I done lately? But when it comes to I guess the like optimism, it's more like if there's a particular task I want to do and I haven't been able to do it, and I see that somebody else has done it, it's like if they can do it, I can do it. So it's more like. They can do it, I can do it. <laughs> okay. Thank you to Sabrina Pistersky, who is an amazing millennial phenomenon. She is studying uh, theoretical physics at Harvard, something called quantum gravity, which I don't pretend to understand. Uh, and she's a geek, and I say this, and she hates it, but this is called the next science sign by Harvard, so no pressure there. Um, it definitely makes me feel like a slacker. Uh, and with that, I say thank you, and please enjoy the conversation. I did because I had a reason to, but 